Hello, it's Friday, August 20th. It's about 4 in the afternoon. And again, I didn't film anything today, but that's okay. Um, it's kind of like an overcast day. It's like 65 degrees here on the Oregon coast. But it's still really nice out. Um, I'm going to go inside and work on my book a little bit. I did transfer it from Scrivener over to Libri, which is what I use to like edit and format the book. Mm -mm. And I like the direction my book is going, and I, I'm pretty sure I'll be able to get it done for Halloween. Just gotta like sit down and crank it out. And we move, we move, we've been moving around a lot, so there's that. But then also, I know that in the beginning of September, we'll be in one spot for 14 days. So I know I'll be able to get a lot right in then. It's just exhausting. Just exhausting. So there's that. Um, I don't know what there is much today. I did have an idea for a video um, topic. It's about like how we live in RV, how we organize things, how we set up and set up and say and set up and take down the RV as we're camping. What do we need to know? What do we wish we known in the beginning? Um, I know this is my writing channel. I know a lot of you know that I live in an RV. So would you be interested in that aspect? Or should I put those type of videos over on my family travel channel? So let me know down in the comments where you would like me to have that information at. Yeah, so yeah, we're on the Oregon coast in on the northern Oregon coast and seaside for a few days. And then we're just gonna stay over here. Still haven't seen buffalo or black bear in Mad Path, but that's okay. Maybe I'll see a gaggle of geese crossing the road here. <sighs> we do have a really nice lodge here in here at the place here and it's open till like nine so i'm thinking of heading over there after dinner and just setting up camp and writing for a few hours like after dinner for like two hours doing that they do have a swimming pool in the hot tub it's really kind of chilly out it's kind of kind of drizzly I don't know how I feel about the kids walking there and back soaking wet because there's no like showers over there. At least I didn't see any. They do have like a puzzle room, a uh, reading room. They have a lodge with like tables and chairs and a fireplace. They have a book exchange and then they have ping pong. What else? Oh, they have horseshoes, basketball, bad like a badminton court, a like a badminton tennis court. Um, hot top swimming pool. The swimming pool is really cool because it's like a regular swimming pool, and the very end is like a little section, like a little like one foot, one to two foot wide section that's like one and a half feet deep. Be perfect for like little kids wading, and then they have a hot tub. And that's all one area, so you don't like, like if you have your kids and you want to keep an eye on them, but still be in the hot tub and not in the swimming pool, you can't do that. And then they have a bunch of tables and chairs in the area next to the swimming pool, so there's that. Don't really have a lot to talk about today. Today's mainly just been like relaxing, chilling out. That's it. We do have dumpsters available to us, which means that I will be able to have a plethora of things out. Like things we haven't used in like three, six months. I'm tossing, tossing, tossing. I'm at the point where I'm like, how you have to like pick up boxes to get to other boxes to get things out. Or just like, we have way too many blankets, way too much stuff. So, and yeah. I think everything's going good. It's not a very exciting vlog, but I did not want to miss a day in my daily vlogs, especially since I have good internet service. 
Okay. I think that's all for today. I promise tomorrow will be more entertaining. Okay. Bye.